had the cool idea for my birthday. Instead of going on like a trip, I wanted to create something and release it on my birthday. And since my birthday is July 21st, I came up with the 21 Day Project, which was a play on the number 21. And also, it was inspired by the concept that it takes 21 days to form a habit. For this year, I did 21 days of peace. For 21 days, I explored the concept of peace of mind through 21 people. And um, yeah, the results were beautiful, man. A lot of times when people hear peace, um, I think it's synonymous with like outer peace, like peace in the world. But this whole project is exploring inner peace. I am essentially interviewing 21 different people, very different people as far as their perspective. But generally there is a commonality as far as like the answers, even though they may be different, the root of them are still the same. And I think um, as far as this project goes, uh, for a lot of people, as far as what peace of mind meant was really just like being still and um, living in the moment. I think that was like a reoccurring thing was just being still and trying to live in the moment. Peace of mind is like letting things flow kind of, being comfortable with yourself or just kind of finding what makes you happy. And spending a lot of time kind of unlocking what it is to be creative and how to dream bigger. Doing what I say I will do. I would say omnipresent awareness brings me peace of mind. Can you elaborate? <laughs> Um, omnipresent uh, means, you know, everything, kind of like all-encompassing and awareness of myself. And I know that's a lot, but that basically just speaks to balance and knowing who you are and knowing where you are and knowing where you are in the world and place and time and, um, and gardening. Bring me peace of mind as well. <laughs> just finding happiness and giving thanks to God for the gifts that he's given me. Um, peace of mind also means for me just staying physically fit um, and healthy from the inside out um, and then peace of mind also just means you know being authentic and being real and keeping it 100 with everybody I meet that's peace of mind letting go of perfectionism perfectionism gives me peace of mind solitude gives me peace of mind yeah a lot of good solitude Dancing, freely moving and dancing, self-expression is a uh, family, uh, friends, of course, and then also the sport I love, playing football, uh, and just being content in the place that I am in life right now. Peace of mind for me is knowing that I know nothing, and just going on the journey and trying to understand myself, that brings me peace, because the world's already chaotic, so I just try to find something I can grasp onto, and that's just me, understanding me and my energy. That's my piece of mind.